your search, your hunt, your quest for the best possible t-shirts end here. Gentlemen, your conquest, your thirst to find the best possible fit ends here. You see, I have been a classic men's style fanboy for well over 8 years now. I have been researching, reviewing and trying a whole bunch of classic men's style items for well over 8 years now. And 8 years is what it took me to find my personal style. Gentlemen, 8 years is what it took me to help you sort your classic style. So, if finding the best possible t-shirts in the country is the question you ask, if finding the best possible essential v-necks and crewnecks is the question you ask, then this video is going to help you a lot. If finding the best possible t-shirts in the country is the need of your hour gentlemen, then I'll be more than happy to help you with it. You see, my name is Mangwara Sarya, this is Men's Essentials and the best possible t-shirts in the country are back. Let's go. First things first before I get into the video. I love my basic tees, be it v-neck, crew neck or whatever that there is. I love it black, I love it white and I just can't get enough of it. So over the years of doing this, over the years of making these lifestyle, style, fashion and fitness videos for you all, I have tried and tested a whole bunch of things. I have tried, tested, bought and thrown away a whole lot of things. Most of it has to do with basic essential t-shirts. You name the brand, you name the fit and I have tried them all. So when it comes down to finding the perfect fit, when it comes down to finding the perfect basic t-shirt for you, I think I know a thing or two more about it. So watch this video with an open mind, watch this video till the very end but with a grain of salt in your tinsy mind. Why? Well because this video is going to debunk and give you a whole lot more knowledge about basic t-shirts than there is. This video is going to open your eyes per se and you wouldn't be wasting your money buying anything stupid ever since. Okay? Ready? Alright, so here we go. Step number one or tip number one? Fit over the fabric. Hear me out again because this is very important. Fit over the fabric. Why? Well, because it's not very important for a shirt to be of Supima Giza cotton if it does not fit you right. Again, I'll repeat it one more time so hear me out clearly. It is not very important for a shirt to be of Supima Giza cotton if it does not fit you Right. A super expensive, super premium quality shirt fitting you ugly is not the way you find, wear or buy the perfect t-shirt out there. Because hey, when it comes down to style and fashion, you'll only look as good as the clothing fits on your body. So, when in doubt, when given a choice, always pick the one that fits you right. Always pick the top, always pick the t-shirt that fits you right. Now, how do you find the perfect fit you ask? How do you really shortlist or discover that perfect fit you ask? Well. Easy. The shoulders, the chest, the arms and the torso at the bottom. I'll repeat. The shoulders, the chest, the shoulders, the chest, the arms and the overall torso and the lower body. Okay, so starting first with the shoulders. The shoulder shouldn't crunch up and make you look like a fucking sausage. That's not how your shoulder should fit on your mighty body. Gentlemen, the shoulders of the t-shirt should sit on your shoulders nice and snug. It should not crunch up and make you look like a sausage. The same applies to your chest as well. The chest of a t-shirt should not be like an Under Armour compression wear. I mean you're not wearing something to the gym, you're wearing a normal t-shirt. So it should be nice and snug. It should be tight but it should not be as tight or as slim as the Under Armour compression gear that you see around or any compression gear for that matter. But it should be nice and snug. This chest should fit you nice and tight. Gentlemen, the sleeves of your t-shirt should not be long, loose and baggy because the longer and the baggier it is, the more aesthetically fucked up you look. And honestly, that's the last thing I want you to do. That's the last thing I would want you to look like. I do not want you to look like a fashion fuck up. I want you to look like a super fashion forward guy. So make sure the sleeves are nice and short. Make sure you're not hiding your arms. You're actually exposing it and showing them nice and around. I mean sure I don't want you to be cocky and keep flexing and be obnoxious about it. I don't want you to do that. But hey I would not have any problems with you showing off your arms subconsciously or very subtly to the outside world. Why? Well because this is attractive. A man's muscular arm is just as attractive as a woman's sexy cleavage. Why would you want to hide your amazing cleavage? So in case you are actually spending some quality time in the gym working on your mighty pectorials and arms, I would want you to show it off the right way. I would want you to show it off properly. How do you do it? By making sure the chest on your t-shirt sits nice and tight so that you can show off your man chest to the outside world and by showing your triceps and biceps proportionally to the outside world. Rule of thirds again. One third is covered, two third is exposed 
and the very best way to do it is by making sure the sleeves aren't too long and the sleeves aren't too big and baggy at all but lastly the lower body the torso or the length of your shirt now i wouldn't want you to wear a crop top so i wouldn't want you to wear something too small or something too short how do you define the perfect length of your t-shirt well you use your belt gentlemen the best way to find the perfect length for your t-shirt is by seeing your belt buckle if it is covering your belt buckle then you are at a good spot if it is at least covering half of your belt buckle you are still at a good spot if it is way below the front pocket of your jeans or if it is way up top your belt then guess what you're either wearing a crop top or you're wearing something loaned away from your grandpa and i don't want you to look like this chick who's wearing a chick's crop top or this guy who is taking his grandfather's old t-shirts to wear inside i wouldn't want you to have that look i wouldn't ever want you to try something of that sort nothing too short nothing too long just keeping it right keeping it slim all the time now one very easy way to find these kind of fits one very easy way to find a t-shirt that fits you similarly is by going out and discovering and trying to hunt down a slim fit t-shirt because i in general always wear a slim fit t-shirt why because it's not boxy it's not baggy it does not have any extra fabric around it sits nice and tight on my chest the sleeves aren't too long and baggy i can roll it up and i can show off my guns the way i want but hey, it's a whole different reason that you can't really find good slim fit t-shirts in this country and that's the exact reason why i made my own yes i made my own yes gentlemen a slim fit super 30s premium cotton one of the best cottons out there for your sexy v necks and crew next needs more about this in a minute but let's just discover more about the perfect t-shirt shall we the tip number 2 or the point number 2 that you have to keep in mind when you are trying to find your perfect t-shirt out there is undoubtedly the fabric now i know i said things otherwise but fit is after the fabric not before the fabric so the number 2 thing the second thing that you have to keep in mind when you are trying to buy yourself the best t-shirt is do make sure you get a decent fabric things like pure cotton is a very good place to start now i wouldn't want you to try out things that are made up of polyester or some other jersey and ganji material i mean gentlemen that is just cheap it does not last long it looks cheap it looks very unattractive it looks very inexpensively made and that's not the look i want you to project or perceive to the outside world i want you to wear a fabric that looks expensive that fits you flawlessly and that lasts really long again a pure cotton is a very good place to start a blend of cotton and spandex is a bit more expensive relatively more expensive but a very good place to be a very good thing to spot things like super 30s cotton spandex micromodal bamboo giza cotton these are much more expensive but they are an option out there available for you in case you do have the money in case you don't mind investing in a premium quality t-shirt that lasts you long and that will fit you flawlessly for a very long period of time these are some of the fabric you should always keep in mind just check the tag the next time you're shopping or ask the shopkeeper that which fabric is it and they'll be able to help you with it pure cotton good place to start cotton spandex cotton micromodal bamboo giza cotton are much expensive options for you out there in the market but hey last and probably the most important t-shirt tip out there whenever you're trying to shop your next t-shirt is finding the right colors or getting the right colors colors like black white are always timeless and are always in style colors like blue navy blue colors like charcoal gray are also very good to try colors like beige and olive a few things you can add on to your must have cry i mean these are some of the most amazing colors out there i am a sucker for black and white t-shirts i have a plethora of black and white t-shirts because i just love the way it looks it doesn't look too shabby it makes me look sharp it makes me look casual but it makes me look a bit more of a bad boy as well and i'm all about that badass bad boy attitude as much as i can i mean i'm not really a badass in general i'm not really a criminal but if i can pull that look off then hey why not also one more side note in case you aren't aware please try some v necks i know everyone loves crew neck i know everyone has crew neck in their wardrobe i know crew neck is a very comfortable space to be and i know v necks are not your comfort space or v neck are not your comfort zone t-shirts but guess what if you are someone who's in the gym if you are someone who's working out if you are someone who has a decent physique a v neck will look so much better on your body why because the v accentuates your natural v type of shoulders waist big broad shoulders narrow waist and it just looks so much better on you i mean if you would have told me about this hack 8 years ago i would have slapped your f***ing mind but now since then since the last 7 and a half 8 years of my existence i have been a v-neck user for life and i can literally swear by this thing trust me gentlemen if you find a good slim fit v-neck t-shirt for yourself if you find yourself a good slim fit black or white v-neck then you'll not go back to anything else ever trust me never Ever. But hey, in case you are wondering where do you find such amazing V-necks or crew necks from, in case you are wondering where can you find amazing slim fit basic T-shirts from, I have 
got you covered i have got your back www.tmbbasics.com yes in case you don't know we have our second launch live yes in case you don't know i have spent one and a half hours mastering this and i have got it ready for your amazing bodies to try in case you haven't gentlemen check this thing out check this t-shirt out once because this is probably the best t-shirt you can buy for the given set price this is a mix of super 30s cotton and spandex and a lot of other cool things which makes it not only the fit that it is one of the best fitting t-shirts you can find but this thing will also last you long this thing is not going to shrink or float after the wash and this thing is going to smell fresh and keep you looking fresh for a very long time i mean honestly speaking i was sick and tired of trying to find my perfect fit of v-necks and crewnecks out there i have been trying to look for a good looking v-neck t-shirt good fitting v-neck t-shirt for a very long time and it was about time i bring this back gentlemen it was about time to bring back these bad boys back in your wardrobe because these t-shirts are probably the best v-necks and crewnecks out there in the indian market guaranteed promised and i swear i'm not kidding on this one in case you haven't go to tamebexes.com try it out once i'm very sure if you just try it once if you just get one of these things for yourself you'll probably buy 15 more and just keep it because you wouldn't want to run out of it ever in your life and and trust me when i tell you this we run out of stock very fast we took 45 hours to run out of stock on our first launch and we have been on pre orders ever since last 3 4 days and we have already sold out half of our inventory only in the pre orders these things are selling out on pre orders so in case you haven't in case you aren't aware In case you do want to get one of these for yourself, I would recommend you do that right now. Get yourself pre-ordered because you will not be missing out on any one of these in case we do run out of stock at the very first launch of this mighty basic. Second October 2019, I'll be making a whole lot more videos about t-shirts and how do you find them and promoting this because I don't want to promote this for the sake of promoting it. I really want people to buy these things because these are the best t-shirts out there for every man's classic men's style needs. I mean that's just how it is and that's how it will be if I make any other products out there in the future it will be only to help you better your life simplify it and make you feel so much more confident and look so much more stylish in absolute no time black and white crew neck and v neck you can see the photos it's all over my instagram you can check out team me basics instagram as well in case you want to pre order by the way you can send us a dm at team me basics on instagram and we'll hook you up with 1 2 4 5 or even 50 of these basics in case you are into that look anyway that's all about this video that's where I'll include this video for a three basic t-shirt tips that you should keep in mind when you're trying to buy yourself the favorite basic t-shirts out there in case you don't want to buy the basics i totally understand but do make sure you keep these points in mind whenever you're going out there trying to buy yourself the best t-shirt out there the fit the fabric the color and the cut right in case you are wondering where do you find the basic t-shirts give me basics.com i have spent hours years and months and weeks to get this thing perfectly made for you <laughs> anyway i'll get back to work i'll keep making videos in case you like this vibe in case you like this video in case you found it helpful and well worth your time then don't forget to let youtube know don't forget to let me know by liking this video by giving it a big fat thumbs up and by writing down your comments by writing down your honest opinions and thoughts in the comment section i'll comment back and we'll have a conversation there in case you want to see more daily outfit inspirations my instagram is a pretty good place but for now i'll have to get back to work i'll have to start shipping these things for you i want you to try these things as soon as you can as soon as i can so that you all can have this amazing basics meet up and do crazy good things anyway i'll see you in the next one gentlemen press up stay strong stay safe my name is bang prasarya best t-shirts in the country are back kimibasics.com press up stay strong stay safe jai